poison. Swim deep enough until you lose sight of the light, past the rough section of love, understanding and desire. Stare down the bottomless pit, recognize your own reflection in the eyes of the beast. Notice the tentacles that reach towards your sense of self. Let them envelop you, start pulling you down, deeper, farther in, as deep as you can bear, a little more. Once you've lost almost all sense, desire, will, start fighting, start swimming, Come back to you, come back to us, back to the light. Open your eyes, see, listen to the voice, hear, acknowledge the poison you carry, understand. Open your mouth, speak. See the reality you inhabit. Hear the sounds that surround you, understand your own tainted nature, speak the truth you carry. Stand up, rise above, move past the interference, recognize the flaws in your actions, accept the consequences of your own. It's thanks to you, thanks to your poison, that the erosion has happened. Do not waver, do not run from the monstrosities in front of your eyes. It's your own shadow first, magnified through the prism of lies and deceit. It's your conscience second, poisoned by your own blood. It's our own nightmares third, the murder of God and sanity. It's the machine and the matriarch fourth created by our insanity. It's the messiah of Western modernity, fifth, the spawn of the former titans. It's all of them combined, sixth, the horror of a tormented psyche. It's the desire to flee, escape, ignore, seventh. This is not me, surely, this is not us. Look at them. Look at it. Look into its eyes deeply. Isn't it familiar? Does it not ring a bell? Can you not see? Do you refuse to hear? Why can't you understand the words it speaks? Somewhere deep down, in a state of limbo we float, paralyzed, locked in place by its gaze, drinking the poison willingly.